TikTok. Oh my god, this song is good. It is good. It hits you from the word go. Like not a huge dance group, but then a bunch of people dancing, you know. You get into the song almost immediately. Tamu kupendo nawe. Tamu kupendo nawe. It's I it's joyous. It makes me feel good. Tamu literally means sweet, but then contextually What up y'all? My name is Maingi. Today I'm going to do a reaction video on Wa. Wa is a song by Diamond Platinums and Kofi Olomide. Okay, now, I've reacted to a few Diamond Platinum songs and a few, okay, a few Congolese songs. None of them Kofi Olomide. Kofi is a really, he's been singing, he's been an artist for like a really long time. He was an artist when I was a kid. He's still an artist, he's still around, he's still alive and kicking. Okay. What do we know about Diamond Platinums? Uh, Diamond Platinums is a Tanzanian artist. He sings his songs in Swahili. They're usually very lively, colorful. So I'm hoping this song does not disappoint. I'm hoping this is a good song. People really enjoyed my reaction video of Tatema. Or they didn't, as they, as they said in the comments. It's really funny stuff. You can check it out. Uh, I'll think, I think I'll put the link somewhere here. Okay. What do we know about these two countries? What do we know about Tanzania? Tanzania is a country of about 50 million people. The national language is Swahili. Um, what else do we know about Tanzania? The official capital is Dodoma. The, the de facto, the, the actual functioning capital, everything is done from Dar es Salaam though. Um, uh, what about the Tanzanian people? Um, uh, I guess you could call them the Swahili. The Basahili, part of a larger group of East African Swahili speakers or something like that. There are very many ethnicities in Tanzania, but then that's that's irrelevant for this video. Okay, now what do we know about Congo? Congo is a huge country. It is home to about 80, 90 million people. The largest city is Kinshasa. Kinshasa is also the capital. Kinshasa is a mega city. It's home to more about 10 million people or more. Uh, it's really growing and uh, it's fast growing. In the west of in the west side of the DRC, they speak Lingala. Um, in the east side, it's Swahili speaking. Um, in and I think the south the center somewhere in the south center south central, it's they speak Shiluba, Shiluba, or something like that. I forgot. I forgot. But the main languages are Lingala and Swahili. Uh, if you go to cities like Goma, if you go to Lubumbashi, if you maybe maybe in Kisangani as well, they speak Swahili. Oh, what else do we know about Congo? Congo is traversed by lots of nature. It has the Congo forest. You have the Congo River, which is like one of Africa's biggest and major rivers. This is stuff everybody should know. Uh, what else about Congo? Congo just recently had elections. Uh, not recently, I mean a while back, but then, you know, still fresh in everybody's minds. There's a new president uh, who was elected. Uh, what do I know about Congolese politics? The new president, he's not getting along with the... He's not getting along with the former president's advisors who were left on from the previous administration. So things are still going like that. But otherwise, it's, it's like that. That's Congo and Tanzania for you. Tanzania is like calm, quiet. They had elections recently. Um, people, there are claims of lots of stuff, but then I'm not gonna delve into politics. I am gonna talk. Uh, what else? What else? What else is going on in Tanzania? Not much. Okay. Okay. What do I know? What else? I I think I should. I'll just do the reaction video for now, and then I'll just let y'all see what's up, so that you know. I'll go to file, I'll go to new screen recording, and then I'll press record. So I'll start the video, watching the video in three, two, one, go. What? Okay, anachukua anaweka. He takes, he places back. I like reacting to Swahili music videos because you know i understand the language and it's like oh uh, always very lovely and i just like how the song also started it started with like a huge with like not a huge dance crew but then a bunch of people dancing you know you get into the song almost immediately and then okay coffee is there 
just being chill, a super chill old guy and doing his Congolese style music, whatever thing. <laughs> Tamu kupendo nawe. Tamu kupendo nawe. It's I. Uh, it's joyous. It makes me feel good. Tamu literally means sweet, but then contextually, if I translate this, so it will say it will mean, um, I'm happy. I, I, I'm happy. It I, it feels good to be loved by you. is good it is good it hits you from the word go it keeps you entertained dancing oh it is good One more thing I like. I like the background colors. Like the people who did the, who thought about this music video. They were really thinking about their audience and how, what, it, what they would like. I like the background. I like the single color background. Okay, as you can see, behind me it's orange. So y'all know what kind of backgrounds I like. Uh, behind Kofi, it is purple and there are people <laughs> dancing. I like the people with the hats. I like the people with the red trousers. It was cool. Okay, let don't touch me. Um don't don't yeah, Usinigusa, don't touch me in Swahili. Usinitachi. It's Sheng. Sheng is a mixture of English and Swahili. Um it's because of the corona pandemic, okay. You guys should have yeah. To salimieni komigu. Let's greet each other using our feet.
WCB Wasafi, director Kenya, Kenny Zoom Extra. Okay, this song was amazing. This song was good. And I'm not just saying that. Come on. Diamond Platinum and Kofi Olomide. Good job. Good job, y'all. This song did not disappoint. Wa is a good song. First of all, I'll just say stream it actually before even commenting on the rest of the section. Okay, now. What will I say I really liked? I like the background colors, the videography, the choreography. Uh, uh, I liked, okay, first let's meet the checkpoints that I usually really like to people to meet. They sang in their local languages. Kofi sang in Bengala. Diamond sang in Swahili. This is a good thing. Always, 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 when an African artist si sings in their local language, I will always appreciate the music much, much more than if than otherwise you know you have somebody in kenya singing in english so this is a kenyan artist they're singing in english this song could be from anywhere but if it's in swahili you're representing your culture you're really really proud of your culture and then you are just emulating you know stuff from that okay what else do i like i like the outfits i like the the kafias looking turkish looking things those are good. I really like them. I'll show them. I'll show those to people what I mean. And then I like, I just generally like the outfits. It's well thought out, except the part where they're wearing all white and it's also white in the ground. Maybe they should have worn yellow, white, all white, maybe in a yellow background or an orange background like this one. Um, what else? What else? What else do we see? Um, what else do I like? I just generally like the feel of the song. It hits you from the word go. Uh, so from the word go, you go like, you start dancing, you just start shaking. You know, you wanna dance. And that's ca the kind of song you also wanna have. Even if, uh, even if you have like foreigners or people who don't understand the language, you wanna get them into the song right from the word go. And it always goes good for the song. You know, okay, even on YouTube, when I'm creating reaction videos, I always watch uh, people, I always watch how the analytics, I, I look at the analytics and see how people watch my videos. And so sometimes after the first minute, you find that people watch and then after the first minute, nobody's watching the video anymore. But then, okay, so for this video, it's really structured in a way where you remain curious about how things work out up until the end of the song. Um, yeah, so it starts off well. They sang in the local languages. They had good outfits. The video, the videography was on point. The choreography was on point. There's actually very little to criticize about the song. Uh, I'm not just rubber stamping this. You know, I actually had to watch this to say, okay, it's a good song. Um, what else? What else do I have to say? I mean, there's nothing else. There's a previous Diamond Platinum song that I reviewed that even... Did I like it? Or... No, this is one of the better Diamond Platinum songs. Let's just say that. I like this one. I like the Tema. I liked, I liked a bunch of them. But then this one, <laughs> this one's really good. Guys, stream it, stream it, stream it, stream it. It's a really, really, really good song. Um, what else? Anything else I should say? I should add? Let's see. Do I have any criticism? I can, I can open my computer. You know, the thing is about this song, I know so much about the artist and the whatever. The background was so well thought out. Like so much of this, is this so well thought out? There's really actually nothing to criticize. I like the group dance thing. Like, you know, like, you know, and many of the songs, I know, I like the choreographed group dance thing. It, it makes it seem more like lively and it's not, and it makes a song not just about the artist. It also makes a song about the people around me. Uh, you know, sometimes it's people, they point to the artist and they tell him, wow, wow, you're doing this. I'll show that in the screen, whatever thing below. But then most of the time you find that it's also not just that. Um, yeah, guys, that's honestly it. That's all I have to say. The song is good. Watch it, stream it. Just stream it. It's, it's a really, really good song. Okay. Now we'll talk about random Tanzania fact. Uh, Tanzania, uh, Tanzania's president, uh, Tanzania has a president. The president's name is Magufuli. 
uh, Magufuli was born in Monza. You see, I do a lot of research, you know, just on my own. I think he was born in Monza. That's in Western Tanzania. Monza is the second largest city in Tanzania. Although it's not what I would say, you know, it's in the West. It's on the lake, on Lake Victoria. Mm. I think Tanzania has the largest share of Lake Victoria. But then seriously. Huh? Oh, the other thing I would also like to say, guys, first, subscribe, like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Um, I know lots of people actually watch my content, but then they don't subscribe. No, guys, first of all, like, share, and subscribe to the channel before we do the reaction video. And I would say thanks. You know, thanks for watching. That's pretty much it. Wow. Stream it. Stream it. You've got to stream it. You've got to, got to, got to stream it. Okay, that's it. That's it.